I'm so tapped up and let's play Inuiji by Cortex Card. This is a um, Pico 8 game, which is like a fantasy console. Like it's all software, but it's this pretend 8 bit console with a particular set of. Uh, hold it A. Restart. But yeah, we are Luigi and we're just sort of. Just sort of bumbling around the old Mario world. What's going on here? Oh. Slightly more beat up pole. It seems the locations are a bit random. Let's say it again. So this game is sort of a weird little thing where Luigi runs around and ruminates on all of this crap that went down in Mario games and obviously a little bit of a downer both from the title and from the music and such. Oh, I should have thought in that last area. I don't know man. weird crackling in the music sometimes. I'm not sure if that's Pico 8's thing. Like, it just started up. It's much more noticeable when using heads headphones. Mario! I like the slightly beat up blocks and stuff we've got going on. Poor Luigi. <laughs> Damn it, Luigi. You've ruined everything. You realize that. <laughs> Poor Luigi. I'm not really sure if there's an end to this thing, but I thought it was neat enough to show off. Though there's that hold A to restart, I'm definitely gonna have to see what that mess is about. If I can't even restart. Poor Luigi. Oh, we've been here before. Different quotes though. Yeah, I think it's just randomized. Take a nice slow drag. Aw oh, dang. I forgot to ruminate. Get to ruminate in Luigi. Luigi. The ruminate button reminds me of that. That arcade game. What is it? That arcade game that Martin is playing in that one Simpsons episode. Where he's like, tell me more. And that's one of the button choices. Well, I gotta go back. Sorry, Mario. Whee. This is one case where the languid pace actually does make some sense. It's been 30 years, I believe, actually. Hup. Hmm. Poor Peachy. Wait, can you ruminate multiple times in one place? I guess you can. Except when there is. Hmm. Ooh. Slightly more degraded one. Eat this mushroom, Lou! Eat this flower! <laughs> you know, it never it never occurred to me to call Luigi Lou. That's that's weird to me. Hmm. 
Initially, I thought the little quotes were tied to what area you bumped into, but I guess they're just all random. Would you kill for one? Would you kill for one, Mario? I don't know. I can't do Luigi voice. I guess that's the basic concept of that. The concept of that. If you're not familiar, Pico 8 games are like uh, that was disorienting. Um, you can just play them in your browser for free. I don't know what software they use if they're HTML5. I kind of doubt they're Flash, but I'm not sure. Um, yeah, you can just go and play this on the website. You don't have to own the Pico 8. You just have to own the Pico 8 to. Um, make games and stuff. It's a really cool idea. I, uh, I'm not sure if you can actually sell games made with it. That's sort of one important thing for, uh, any game development software, in my opinion, but, uh, I'm not super familiar with Pico 8. I really love the palette that it has, but, um, I haven't messed with it yet. I've sort of been thinking of messing with some hobbyist game dev stuff, but it's also... Kind of a lot of work, and I kind of got a lot of side projects already going on, so... Wow, there is a lot of quotes. Let's break it. Kind of a monster, Mario. Yep. I was kind of hoping the things got more degraded as you went on, but it seems like it's just random. Oh, well. Let's ruminate... <laughs> Um, well, let's, let's try that reboot and hold A. I held A. What's... Hmm. Let's try that one more time. Just hold A all the way through. Ah. Oh, it just skips straight into the game? Hmm. Well, I guess that's pretty much all there is to it. There's probably a ton more random quotes, but uh, you get the idea. That is Anuigi.